Welcome back to River City Live. Local artist Hiromi Moneyhan specializes in, in the Japanese art of paper cutting. Her work is so intricate that it can take her months just to finish one piece. We rolled out to her studio in Jack's Pe Beach to see how she creates her masterpieces. Take a look. I'm from Japan, and in Japan, paper cut art is not like an unusual medium. And uh, I grew up with uh, a lot of like a paper cutout like, illustration in children's book. So I'm very familiar with the, you know, the image of paper cut. That's why I started paper cut. My name is Hiromi Manihan. Uh, I'm a paper cut artist. I started like uh, about several years ago, just at home. Just I just started, uh, and and just since then, since I finished first piece, I just keep keep on creating. And just for a while, I hid all those paper cut out, uh, paper cut uh, work under my bed. One day, actually, my husband is the one pull all pieces out from the bed, under, from under the bed, and, and yeah, start showing <laughs> the pieces to people. I, did, I wasn't thinking, oh, this is my secret stuff, but just, I, I, I just really enjoyed the process, you know, uh, drawing and paper cutting. My intention wasn't like uh, to show people. Like I just making myself for myself. So I I didn't even think my my paper paper cut became like you know now. Every piece I finish, I still feel like okay, I can do better image technique is. Good. I think uh, uh, cutting out part, but just subject or images, I feel like uh, I still can do better, or I can do something different. So appreciate people's comment, but still I feel like uh, uh, I'm not maybe not enough yet. <laughs> After a couple of hours of especially cutting process is started uh, starts kind of painful <laughs> but same time it's it's meditation I just can't stop I just kind of focus cutting process is definitely to me meditation but a little painful I don't know how many I can finish for, for the show, but at least a few, a few pieces are gonna be at the show. That is some amazing work. If you'd like to see more, go to rivercitylivetv.com and click on the As Seen on RCL tab.